Good morning guys, welcome back to my channel. I just spent all morning working on the haul. I filmed the um, sit down portion of it today, so it's finally all filmed. I just gotta find time to edit it, hopefully later today, maybe? But today is finally like fall weather. It's gonna be like 55 degrees, which is pretty freaking chilly. So I will give you guys a quick outfit of the day. This is all stuff from the haul. So I'm wearing, um, well, these jeans are. These are ASOS petite jeans. You guys know I wear these all the time. This um, black turtleneck is from Forever 21, link down below. And this jacket is my new favorite thing ever. Can you tell how soft it is? Because it literally feels like a blanket. I am addicted. So I just threw this on because we are going out to a little lunch. It's gonna be me, Zane, his mom, his stepdad, and then my parents. We're going to like an all you can eat sushi kind of Japanese restaurant place that we love here so I'm really really excited but I do get super super cold in restaurants so I figured I'd add an extra layer instead of just wearing a black turtleneck so we've got some extra layers because I like to be warm when I eat I don't like to be cold okay so with that being said we are supposed to be leaving in one minute so I'm gonna pee quick and then we're gonna head out oh and also these shoes that I'm wearing I don't really remember I think like Rose Gal or one of those like Chinese wholesale companies. So I'll try and find something and link it down below. I'm sure I'll be able to find them, but I'll try. But I'm actually impressed with them. They're actually like really nice quality. They're super comfy and I feel like they look really high end. So I really like them. The only thing is that they, um, they click. Yeah, not a big deal, but. <laughs> oh baby, is everybody hungry? Can I get a hoe yeah? Oh yeah, oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, they just brought us a bottle of wine on the house. Is this wine? I don't even know what it is. I think it's wine, yeah. Wow. So they're starting to incorporate iPads, and they said we're the first table to use the iPad, so we're celebrating. <laughs> How cute. That's so nice. Oh, should we have him cheers with us? What's your name? Michael. Michael. Okay, so we just got home. I'm already in my comfy clothes, so don't mind me. But look at this. We got the whole fam bam fitting on the couch. How amazing. We're just missing Amani and Aaliyah. Got my little candle lit. You guys don't know how long I've waited to have a little family gathering in my own living room with my candle lit. It smells so good. It's just so exciting. But we've got Amazon Hall with Listen Zane. <laughs> Amazon Hall with Listen Zane. Where are you on the second verse? Come on. Wow, look at how well that works. I'm not works. used to doing this in front of a live studio audience. <laughs> oh, we, have, we have audience members today. I think these are our door handles, so I guess <gasps> We got the stash, yo, don't look. And these are, wow, look at this fancy packaging. Is that the uh, doorknobs? Doorknobs, link down below. Wow, Alyssa, you did good, look at that. <laughs> what happens to the, to the lines of painting? Yeah. They're, They're ugly. Chipper, right, That's the Marlboro bike. Yeah. yeah. They were not expensive yeah. anyway. That for the bathroom for and house. for our bedroom, we got two lock ones. And then we're yeah. going to use an old one for the bathroom closet. Yeah. Okay. Good and that's number. it for our haul, you guys. I'm just sitting here editing. We're all sitting on the couch just talking. Oh, it's so yellow. Hold on. My dad just <laughs> fell asleep. Oh, I missed it because I tried to reset the yeah, thing and I wasn't fast enough. He's falling asleep with a phone in his hand. He was watching it with Zane's stepdad and he just fell asleep. <laughs> Finally finished editing, you guys. It feels so good. It's almost like 5 o'clock right now. My mom is sleeping on the couch over here. No, Everyone fell asleep while I was editing for that last like hour and a half. But it's time to get some things done. Zane's stepdad is gonna help me put on the handles that we ordered. You guys see, saw, see English. 
saw us open them on the vlog. I mean, on the haul. I can't talk. We're gonna put this right here. Oh, baby, line it up. Put the handle on. Brand new doorknob. Look at that. Nice and shiny, squeaky clean. Okay, we got them all on. Look how beautiful. We still have to do the little latch right here, but that's like a whole nother project in itself, so we're not gonna do that today. But it's beautiful. And we got one on here on our uh, bedroom closet. And we also put one on the bathroom. Here we go. Beautiful. And now that that is done, we are going to do with the handles so if you guys didn't uh, see the vlog we got these for the drawers so these will go right here and cover the previous hole quite nicely but there is a slight issue with the um, cabinet handles so these are the ones that we got to put on here but as you can see we puttied this whole close which is not very um would you say hiding it's very visible so we're gonna have to do something about that maybe we'll throw a little bit of white paint over it I'm not too sure but the Handles are gonna go like probably up here, so you're still gonna be able to see that hole We'll have to figure out what to do about that. But other than that, I think they're gonna look great My dad's got this fancy little uh, measuring tool so we can tell where we're putting it on every single one It'll be even all That's over the highest one right here. That's the highest we can Throw go size. Yeah, seriously how much high That's not much higher than the hole well, that's where it's supposed to be according to the template. What is this? That's for drawers. Oh. So after a long decision process, we were gonna drill another hole in the template because it didn't have one that was higher up. So we ended up going with the ones that are already in the template and it's just a little bit higher than the hole that was originally there. But honestly, it looks way better than, there's something in my eye, like a piece of fuzz or something. It looks way better than the hole that was originally there. That was like way too low, but now it's just a little bit higher than that. So I think it looks fine. So we're just gonna go ahead and do it. Honestly, whatever at this point. I just want handles on the cabinets. Something is in my eye. Ouchie. Do you see like a big piece of fuzz? So how cool is this? So he just marked off the spots that we need with blue tape and then he drills a hole through. Are you taking it off? Nice. Oh, you did the other one too already. Wow. Why do they look uneven, Dad? Because the doors are uneven. <gasps> the doors have to be fixed. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Not scared me for a second to be the same every time oh, okay so yeah he got this at home depot but how cool is that i feel like that makes it easy for like anyone to be able to install their own handles i feel like i can do this now you can go home yeah you probably can do it <laughs> probably but yeah i'm really excited to get handles on because i feel like i am so sick of like grabbing the cabinets from underneath i expect that was a cute ocean <laughs> Especially these big pantry ones because I can't open the top one without opening the bottom. So I had to bend all the way down, open the bottom, and then open the top one. It's a pain in the butt. So I'm excited to get handles on all of these. Plus, it looks like really plain and boring right now. So once we have like the hardware on it, I think it'll like add a little bit of spice, you know? Okay, here we go. First one's going on. Yeah, yeah. Let me see. Let me see. I'm so excited. <laughs> oh, Dad, you were not supposed to drill one in there. Jeez, I just realized. Why? Because there wasn't handles on there. So what? I don't know if I have enough handles. Okay, screw it now. I thought we talked about that. And you're like, no, oh, the, way it, the way it was was there was just one on this side and not on that side. But it's fine. I think I have like two extra. I was going to use them for the cabinet in the mudroom, but it's okay. <laughs> I don't know how after all that drilling I just realized that. No, it's fine. It's not a big deal. I don't think Zane wanted a handle there, but he's going to have to have a handle there. Oh, I just missed the glass. We just missed the glass. That would have been bad. Yeah. We didn't even think of that, huh? <laughs> Drilled a hole straight through there. Glass is right on the back. Oh wow, it's literally right next to the glass. I also realized while editing that yesterday I told you we went to go get something from Let Go. Please don't mind the noise. And I never showed you what we got. So we got this dresser. We're gonna paint these edges white. And I also just realized that it didn't come with handles, but we got this for $15 from Let Go. I also ordered white contact paper to stick on the back of here. And then we're gonna be putting this tabletop right here. We're gonna sand it down and um, stain it so that it'll match our countertops. And we're gonna make it into an island. And I just realized that we have 20 of these handles so we'll be able to put them on here as well how cool dad wow. I have extra of these so we have enough to put them on here too in the middle yeah no on each side I'll cover the hole yeah I'm putty in no more holes. Amazing. That's freaking awesome. While all that is going on though, Zane went to the mall because as you know, he is going to Amsterdam. Also, I saw some of you guys asking for what he's going for business. If you guys remember when we were in LA, I know a lot of you guys haven't been watching for that long, but we recently were in LA and he went for business reasons and that business reason is carrying over to him going to Amsterdam, which I'm so 
jealous for we went two years ago I, I think it was and it was one of the best trips of my life and we went for the same thing for ADE it's like uh, Amsterdam music festival event thing and it was amazing and I'm super jealous and I wish I was going with him but he's gonna be in meetings all day so I'm not going to and if he wasn't if he was just gonna go to the events I would be going with him no doubt because I loved Amsterdam but I'll have those vlogs linked down below because I know a lot of you guys weren't watching back then it was a long time ago but I loved it anyways how are you my love I'm tired you're tired let me see what you got Hall with Zane. <laughs> <laughs> I went to Forever 21 Cotton On. We can twin! I have the same ones! Yeah. How cute! I love those. Yeah. Those are the ones I told you to get yesterday. Yeah, yeah. exactly. And a lot of, uh, it's like a staple. For like the it is. That I'm into, you mm -hmm. know? I like those a lot. Yeah. But Good choice. I went to Forever 21. Nothing? They have a lot of cool know. men's stuff online. Ooh, whack. Really? So whack. You have to shop online then. I've been shopping online so for Forever 21 and it's so much better. I was in with the other one. And all closed in 6 o'clock. There will be a lot of like either really weird stuff or... And that's like, how Forever 21 right. is. You pick something no, up and you're even, like, oh, this is nice. Even then even it says like, I love like, tacos. Like, I was looking for simple like long sleeve black shirts with the yeah. graphics and white long sleeves and like nothing like it was like you know like you can't go colors. shopping looking for something specific you have to just like find well stuff. i kept an open mind and there's nothing really nothing. I was looking for i was looking for jackets as well oh that stinks oh, i'm sorry know. it's okay you have a lot of nice clothes bring everything down here we'll set it up in the closet look handles oh my god i didn't even notice you like them nice. you walked in here you didn't even notice yeah, that you had to hold a handle <laughs> i think the door is open then like, oh 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 but bring all your clothes down. We'll set them up in the closet. I'll help you make outfits. You'll be good. I got you. Don't worry. You see all the clothes I buy? <laughs> oh, damn it. What? I just poked through my putty. You went to the wrong hole? Alrighty, guys. Here's some updates. We got all of the handles on. Now we're working on these. These. Look at how cute they are. I am obsessed. There's a lot going on over here. <laughs> Wow, that looks a little crazy, but it's okay. But anyways, these have been a pain in the butt. We had to get them lined up. It was a struggle, but now they're finally on. Give me a chair, yo. Sorry. <laughs> Zane ran out to the store because he is leaving tomorrow night. So we want to be able to get our dresser and our nightstand so that we can get those together and move all of our clothes down here. And he wanted to get that ASAP because we found one at, at Big Lots that we really, really love. So he ran out to get that. He should be back with it. And then we'll try to build it tonight. Building furniture feels like it'll be easy and it's really not. It takes forever. So we're going to try and get done as much as we can so that I can bring over like my pajamas, my leggings, my bras, my underwear, like everything that can't hang, my socks and stuff like that. Plus it was really affordable and it looks really nice. So I'll have link down below if you guys are interested i'll show you obviously when he gets here what it looks like we actually vlogged it a few vlogs back um and we decided to get it now so i'm really excited about that that means our bedroom will basically be done because we ordered our bed frame our mattress is coming we have the nightstand we have our dresser we have my mirror sitting in the corner and then my desk is going to go in the other corner and then other than that it'll just be like little decor pieces so that was a lot of talking wow so the bedroom is basically done is what i'm trying to say look at this guys my dad just put the template on here and he's like can you go get me a measuring tape he's like i might just eyeball it and he put it on top of his eyeball and it's supposed to be seven and a quarter in the middle exactly seven and a quarter how do you do it teach me your ways just make a youtube channel already so yeah i stayed back to help my dad out and just spend time with him my mom isn't feeling very well so she's laying on the couch so he ran out to do that by himself or else we would have had big lots of adventures with Liz and zane and it would have been really fun but it's fine we'll have building adventures with Liz and zane and we'll make it up to you i promise i also was just reading comments on yesterday's vlog and all of you were saying that i should put my desk in the bedroom and that's honestly what i was rooting for so i think that's what we're gonna do no let's definitely what we're gonna do okay so zane just got back home brought in the dresser and they only had one nightstand so i'm gonna have to pick the other one up on thursday while he's gone and he's bringing in all his clothes and you think i had a lot of clothes look at this man look at this man look at this man oh my god i did not know you had that much clothes did you yeah, my closet's pretty big, huh? Holy guac! Like, this is honestly it because this is all like pajamas, and also, I'm gonna. That's why I told you, I'm gonna bring everything down and we're gonna like get rid of it. Oh my god, I literally did not know you had this many clothes. I really thought I it was. probably wear a quarter of this. That's why. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm sure. Everything right now. Everyone's like that, though. You're not like wrong for no, that. I would prefer to just have everything in my That everything that you wear. Like, right, yeah. right, right. Yeah, but realistically, that's super hard to do. Can you help me? I'm almost done. I need some assistance. I cannot believe you have that much clothes. That's crazy. Yeah. I didn't think you had that much clothes. You were talking all this rah-rah that I had to get rid of stuff. Man, now you need to get rid of stuff. I want to get rid of stuff. 
I don't want to. <laughs> Before I help him in there with that, because he's still bringing more stuff down, I am vacuuming the living room really quick. I'm going to empty this before I continue. It's getting pretty, pretty full. Oh my god, it picked up so much. I saw a lot of you guys say that you have this vacuum too and you love it, which makes me so happy because we kind of just went off Amazon reviews. But we're going to empty it for the first time. Let's see if I can do this without instructions. Here we go. You got a little clip on the side in front. Put it in the bag and then put your finger in it. In the front. Aren't all things different? Yeah, but I don't think this bag is big enough. It's gonna go all over the carpet. You think so? Yeah. You know what I mean? Okay, there's one white bag right there next to my computer bag. Grab that. Yeah. This doesn't have a hole in it, does it? Oh my god, look. It has a big hole in it. Put this underneath it, maybe. I don't want to get it on the carpet. Now what? Mine clips. Push yes. Oh See? Oh yeah. my god. <laughs> Whoa. Take it. Check it out, you guys. Look how easy it is to snap it back into place. That's it. Donezo. Okay, so Zane's room upstairs is almost empty. He's just bringing the last of it down. So while he's doing that, I'm going to start by hanging up what I know he's going to keep because I know he wants to get rid of a lot of it. It's going to kind of bother me for a while that he has those kind of hangers because I like the black felt hangers and he doesn't, but it's okay. I mean, he said he doesn't care if we want to get them, we can, but for now, I don't think it's a necessity because we both have a lot of clothes and like mine are mostly on it. I mean, I just have a few extra things that like I ran out of hangers for, but his, we would need a lot more hangers. So maybe it'll be a good Christmas gift. We'll, we'll do that later. Okay I got a good dent out of it hung most of it up But I'm gonna take a pause and we're gonna build our dresser because a lot of this stuff of his is like PJs and socks and undies and stuff That need to go in the dresser plus I want it built before he leaves tomorrow night So we're gonna try and get it built. It's a big ass dresser and it came in this tiny ass box So I'm assuming there's a lot of little pieces. So we're gonna try to do it as quick as we can ready yes. Okay tips on YouTube. Look at them being YouTubers. Okay, everyone, it has been a really long time, like probably at least two hours, maybe two and a half hours. We got the whole base of it done. It was actually pretty easy, just super, super time consuming. I got one draw put together so you can see the vision, but it is already after midnight. Zane and I are both getting very hangry, which is not good. Getting tired, cranky, and hangry. Not a good mix. Trying to build a dresser, mm, not fun. So we're gonna run out, and um, the only place that is like 24 hours to eat is McDonald's, so we're gonna go get some McDonald's. Also, the last steps of this is kind of a lot of banging, and everyone is sleeping upstairs, so I feel bad banging down here, so probably just gonna finish this up tomorrow. Not a big deal at all, but. Let's go get some food. Are you ready? I'm ready, champ. McDonald's Adventures with Liz and Zane. <laughs> Hi, welcome to McDonald's. What can I get for you today? Hi, can I have a number nine with no pickles? You want Diet Coke? Medium? Uh, yes. And to drink? Uh, a Diet Coke, please. Anything else? There you go. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you. Have a good night. You too. Fries, 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 fries. Oh, baby, guys. What do we got? What do we got? You, you guys want to know. Um, a half-eaten medium fry that I ate in the car. Zane's small fry. I got myself two cheeseburgers, no pickles. I don't know why I have such an awkward angle that I'm trying to lean into. And a 20 nugget. Sweet and sour. So we're going to enjoy. I'm going to end the vlog here so that we can relax. We're going to watch some Chopped and... Um, yeah, just relax for the night, enjoy some food, enjoy our new little apartment. So sorry if I mispronounced this, but today's notification shout out goes to Equestron101. Thank you so much for watching, and thank you for being a part of the notification squad. It means the absolute world to me. I love you so very much. If anyone else would like a notification shout out, comment down below, letting me know that you have my notifications turned on, and you might be in my next video. I love you guys so much. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you all next time. Bye, guys. <laughs>